Good evening, everyone. This is the playoffs of the PSL President's Cup 2024. It's the battle of the middle teams. Andoy Australia has been their main scorer in their last three games. Felix Apreco is the number one rebounder here in the league. The Escobets are number nine in coming into tonight. John Cantimbuan, he did not play in their last three games, but he is their main man. Riosi Koga was solid hitting shots from the outside in his last three games. Juan Monti is number eight coming into this game. Welcome to the Field Oil Eco Oil Center here in San Juan. The San Pedro Pablo Escobets will take on Juan Monti Homes Realty. Hello everybody with uh, Melo Navarro. My name is Sandy Grumo. And uh, Maris Victoria will join us later at the side. Magandang gabi sa iyo, Melo Navarro. Magandang gabi, Sandy. And uh, magandang gabi sa lahat ng fans ng PSL. This is Playoffs Basketball already. Yes. Uh, saan talaga natin? Bakbakan na. Mula dito sa dalawang kupunan natin. At kumusta naman natin si uh, Maris Victoria? Kumusta yung mga teams natin na uh, playoffs na ngayon? Yung atmosphere nila doon. Kumusta na po, uh, Maris? Yes, Sandy and Melo. For one munti, mixed emotions ang nararamdaman nila. Halo-halong kaba, pressure at saya. Pero mas lamang daw ang saya at excitement dahil they are ready for this. Now for San Pedro Pablo Escobets, they will be aggressive and will remain aggressive for the rest of the ball game. Gentlemen? At sabi nga natin kanina, Battle of the Middle Teams, nasa gitna ito, 8 versus 9. So tingnan natin yung playoff picture natin, Melo. This is an interesting uh, playoff picture that we have here. Ito nga dalawang kupunan na ito, number 8 and number 9. So dikit lang to sa team standings. We could expect both of these teams to really go all out tonight. And uh, ito nga panig ng one month, you know, enjoying it twice to be the advantage. But tinan natin in, in this ball game if ito nga San Pedro will find a way to climb that huge mountain. You know, San Pedro, Pablo Escobets, they are not the ninth seed. They are they have good numbers to talk about, but by the way. Tingnan natin yung mga numero, uh, Melo. They are sixth in the league in the scoring 84.9 points a ball game. Pinakamaganda dito yung rebounding nila. It's at 45.2. But look at that, yung offensive rebound. Second in the league, 16.8 mm -hmm. per ball game. That's something that Juan uh, Monti really needs to check in this game. In this game. Well, uh, the guy, the main man, Andoy Estrella, so many big games that he was able to deliver for the team. Well, itong si Estrella has been the go-to guy. He had uh, 14 points, 3 rebounds, 6 assists, and uh, 2 steals in their last outing, shooting 77% from the free throw line. Talagang uh, asahan sa kanya ngayon, no? yung solid performance, yung pag-facilitate sa kanyang kukunan, he will be uh, relied on pagdating nga, especially doon sa mga crucial moments of this ballgame. And now, uh, Felix Apreco, he may be the number one rebounder here in the PSL, but he need to score also for the team. Well, that is true. Right? Uh, Antoine Estrella cannot do things alone yes. in terms of scoring. So itong si Felix Apreco, being uh, the leading rebounder in this team, eh, kakailanganin din talaga maging active in the offensive end. He is, he is only averaging 9 points a ball game. Pero yun nga, yung offensive rebound siya is at 12. And the uh, free throw shooting niya is at 55% here in the tournament. So again, itong nga si Felix Apreco has to be more aggressive. He needs to get more touches off that basketball. And kakailanganin yung kanyang offensive production. On the other side of the floor, Juan Munti, if you will compare their numbers in terms of scoring, San Pedro is so far away against Juan Munti. But Juan Munti is the ninth, the eighth seed coming into this ballgame. Well, itong ang, uh, Juan Munti only averaging 77.3 points a ball game, 16th in the league, which means yung kanilang depensa, ang kanilang mm -hmm. sinasandalan. And that is something that will be tested against a strong team, itong ang, uh, San Pedro. John Cantimbuan, he's been on and off in this game. May mga injuries siya. Ngayon, nakita natin, nakaupo siya. Pero maglalaro siya uh, mamaya. Nung maganda yung mga numeros niya, pag naglalaro siya, he will deliver for the team. Itong si uh, John Cantimbuan has been the barometer of this team. Every time he plays good, eh, nananalo sila. In uh, averages nga niya, 16 points a ball game, 5 assists, shooting 46% from the field and 66% from the free throw line. Nakausap natin kanina si John and sinabi nga niya, he is going all out today. Yes, Rossi Koga. Nung wala naman si uh, John Cantimbuan, siya naman yung nag-deliver para sa kupunan ng uh, Juan Monti. Uh, one of the veterans here, the PSG Koga. Natin natin, no, na pagdating talaga sa mga big-time basketball games, he is uh, willing and ready to show up and this is no stranger para sa kanya. Itong si uh, Ryusei Koga has been averaging 10 points a ball game and 4 assists. Also, uh, making at least 2.5 three-pointers per ball game. So, alam naman natin that he's also one of the focal points sa opensa nitong kanyang kupunan. And in their first game during the elimination round, San Pedro defeated Juan Munti at the Paco Arena last February 6, 75-71. to Tikit yung labanan. It was indeed a close game at uh, doon nga sa larong yun. Ano? Itong uh, Juan Munti only shot 36% from the field, 27 out of 73 
At ang pinakamaganda about San Pedro that game, yung kanilang team game, 24 assists compared to the 14 of Juan Munti. Also, they were able to uh, dictate the tempo of the ball game, scoring 22 fast break points. Now we go to our marquee matchup, Marlon Monte versus Harold Arboleda. Puro mga veterano ito. No, these are two of the best guys that we have here. Marlon Monte, more of a scorer, scoring 12 points a ball game, uh, grabbing four rebounds and four assists. So on the other side, ito naman si Harold Arboleda, more of a facilitator, more yeah. of a rebounder. Almost averaging double-double in those departments. Nine point, uh, eight points rather, nine rebounds and nine assists. Ayun yeah, ngang last game nila ng uh, uh, Juan Monti ay nag-triple-double. Ang taas pa ng mga numero pinakita ni uh, Harold Arboleda. Now we go back to Maris Victoria. Maris? Yes, Sandy and Melo. Pressure arises for Juan Monti as they once again battle San Pedro Pad. Pablo Escobets, but get this, for Juan Muti head coach, Coach Vin Salvador, defense del talaga ang key to win for today's game. And when hearing Juan Muti, they want to be known as the players with a solid foundation of brotherhood. Dito natin makikita na sa hirap at ginhawa, magkakasama-sama pa din sila. They will just be competitive and play their hearts out. Now for San Pedro, Pablo Escobets, there's just one thing that Coach Ned Parado holds on to. Ito yung paghihirapan ng mga players para makuha ang panalo. They... They beat one Munti back in the eliminations and this time they will go all out just for it to happen again. Next man up mentality ang approach nila para sa game na ito ngayon. Now we are about ready to start this ball game. Geo Cruz, take it away. Good evening, PSO fans, and welcome here inside the Phil Oil Echo Oil Center, San Juan City. This is the playoffs of the 2024 Filipina Super League President's Cup. It's the battle between the San Pedro Pablo Escobets and the Juan Monti Serhoes. And now let's meet the starting lineups from your super teams. Beginning with your San Pedro Pablo Escobets. Starting forward number five, Marlon Monte. Also at forward number 40, Felix Abreku. Playing center number 11, Clark Heriger. Starting guard number 18, Andoy Estrella. Also at guard number 4, The Snake, Alan Mangahas. Head coach, Lel Parado. Assisted by EJ Devesa, Pot Casaniera, Kevin Parado, Julio Checo, Philip Salonga, Anthony Battaglia. Team manager, Serafin Matias Jr. and team owners, Pau Emilio and James Mark Pagliani. And now let's meet the starters from your Juan Monti Suhoes. Starting forward number 22, Harold Arbuleda. Also at forward number 21, Muhammad Serif. At center number 13, Vincent Alves. Starting guard number 22, John Katim Buhan. Also at guard number 55, Jose Koga. Head coach, Vinci Salvador. Assistant by Jules Hidalgo, Raymark Francis Oval. Team manager, Ado Salazar. And team owner, Drew Guevara. Our game officials, Garci Ferrer, Toti Celeste. The starting five for the San Pedro, Pablo Escobets, Andoy Estrella, Marlon Monte, Felix Preco, Alan Mangahas, and Clark Derigue. Juan Munti will start with Yossi Koga, John Cantibuan, Vincent Alves, Muhammad Sarip, and Harold Arboleda. The officiating crew in this game, Ferrer, Celeste, and uh, Manyalak. And for the jump ball, it's going to be Apreco and Alves. And uh, the San Pedro Pablo Escobets controlling the tip, Felix Apreco. We talk about him during our intro. Mangahas, tabingi yung tira sa labas. The rebound is Sarip. And itong si Alan Mangas, also one guy who needs to step up his game here in the... Dahil nga alam natin, importante talaga eh. Makikita mo rin yung uh, starting five of both these teams. Not letting... Not leaving anything to chance. Outside to Sarip, here is John Cantimbuan, their main guy. The three, yes, what did I say? The main guy. The main guy it is. Para dito sa one munti itong ang si uh, John Cantimbuan scoring his first three-pointer in this ball game, And we could expect more. Marlon Monte. Ang daming mga nakakalusot itong si Marlon Monte. Ang problema lang, marami din siya mga attempts. Yung conversion lang yung oh, problema. Oh, you know, sometimes it's keeping things simple para ito kay Marlon. On that last drive, binali pa niya. He could have taken that uh, floater of his. Ika nga eh, pinapahirapan yung sarili. <laughs> Riyosi Koga. 
Outside for three. Back-to-back -back threes by Juan Monti. And that's one guy who knows how to play effective basketball. You say Koga, nag-sag down yung kanyang defensa, knocking down that three-pointer. De Rige misfires from the outside. Alves the rebound. Koga setting up the table for Juan Monti. Played big in his last game there at the Caloacan Sports Complex. Sarif for three, way off the target. Ball goes out of bounds. It will stay with one Munti. Six to nothing is the count. And with the five on the floor right now, one Munti, makikita mo, wala talagang uh, post player, no? walang back to the basket. That's why they're taking a lot of outside shots. Yeah. Rio C. Koga. Five seconds to shoot, and John Cantimbuan scoring there in an early timeout by the San Pedro Pablo Escobets. Don't be confused, uh, Melo Navarro. Nakakita ka lang ng uh, kaibigan natin eh. Na-confuse ka na kaagad. At uh, ito, tingnan natin. Well, I've been confused with that layup mula dito kay Cantimbuan. That was too quick for him. <laughs> we'll be right back. The PSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentlemen's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life, Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, live at IBC 13. One Munti with an early lead here. Five points already for the main guy. For the main man, uh, John Cantibuan. Eight to nothing is the count here. Melo. Felix Apreco. Outside to Australia for three. That is their main scorer. He misses that one. Marlon Monte. Well, that has been the story so far. Nakukuha nila yung mga tira. Just couldn't buy the baskets. Talking about itong uh, oh, San Pedro. John Cantimbuan with a beautiful move inside. Basket will count plus a foul. And he, he went down hard. John Cantimbuan is a man on a mission in this game already. Has seven points across his name. And a chance to add to that. Tinan natin to early offense. Para dito sa panig ng Juan Munti. John Cantimbuan skying high for that lane. Ooh. And you know, he's been on and off in, here in the PSL. Uh, na, nakausap nga natin sa kanina yung mga injuries niya. Eh. No? Nung naglaro din siya sa Binyan, maganda na sana yung nilaro. Kaya sabi niya, yung floor daw may dependensya. <laughs> Kaya na-injured siya. Mangahas. Andoy, 4-3. Wala pa rin. Alves the rebound. Alves is 26 years old. Getting the rebound that time. 10 to nothing onslaught here by Juan Munti. John, 4-3. Rebounded by Dirige. It's another good look. Mula dito kaya John Cantimbuhan. Dirige. 4-3. Zero of two from beyond the arc. Mangas will try to score and he does. The Escobaves. They are back here. Inside of Field Oil Eco Oil Center. And that is added motivation. Para dito kaya Al Alan Mangas. Ano, that is the first field goal for them. 10 to 2 is the count now. Kantim Buhan. Outside, we go to Mohamed Sarep. Panira na yun eh. No? Pero, okay lang. Nascore naman ni uh, Sarep going glass. We'll talk about patience right there and ball movement para dito sa one Munti. Another easy basket for them. Australia. Short. Wala. Yung mga tira ni Australia sa labas. Puro kapos ano? No, fighting blank so far. John Kantim Buhan. He's like a man on a mission here as Koga will try and Koga will score. This backcourt combination of Jan Cantimbuan and Yusei Koga very deadly, especially when they are waxing hot from the both, outside. Both players are on fire here in the first period. San Pedro Pablo Escobet still trying their luck from the outside. Two points for Dirige. And this is one thing that uh, Juan Munti needs to check dahil nga uh, San Pedro is uh, second in the league in terms of offensive rebounding at 16.8. Ina natin to a missed shot from Alan Mangahas, but, but they were there to do the cleanup job. Uh, Drigue, uh, a new acquisition by the way. This is his fourth game if I'm not mistaken. Pariliagas, I don't think he's in the bench right now. And you know, Jomar Santos not in the starting lineup for the San Pedro Pablo Escobets. 
Pero itong si Ah. Pero the three-point play. Oo, oh, itong si Ah Derigi nga, no? earning yung kanyang uh, spot dito sa kanyang kupunan. Proving that he could also batter it out underneath. Well, welcome to the playoffs. We are glad that you can join us. Sarep outside to Alves. John Cantimbo on shot clock reads 10. Wide open layup. No, I did not say it correctly. It, he was bothered there. Nice block by Gintaran. That's a great defense. Mula dito kay uh, Rich Gintaran. Let's take a look at that again. Off the handoff. Kala ko na iwan na eh, no? Oh, he was able to keep in step. And that long oh. arms of his was used to his advantage. You know, Ginitaran uh, can score from the outside also. Mangahas. Koga chasing him. Ginitaran for three. Yes! Their first from downtown after missing several shots. And that's what you call a two-way player, no? Tong si Ginitaran. After a defensive stop on the other end, knocking down a three-pointer, that's the value of having Rich in your team. And also, Daryl Karangia, not in the starting lineup, para dito sa kupunan ng uh, San Pedro Pablo Escobets. And that's a three-pointer from John Cantimbuan. It has turned out to be a shootout here in the Filo Oil. This is the wild, wild west. <laughs> Ball goes out of bounds. Uh, Mark Sarangay coming in for Alves. You know, Alves, he may not be scoring, but he provides the spark downstairs. He can rebound the ball. A good hustle player, Michael Machon. Now, I can say now, this is a tall lineup. Tall lineup indeed, no matching up. Itong si Apreco and Derigi on the other end. But look at that. Zan Cantimbuan, I don't understand why he is left wide open from the three. Was it a three-pointer or a two-pointer? Whoops. So are they going to... Yeah, yeah. two points. Nangyari naman sa Golden State at Lakers in Tampa. Ito, nakatapak eh. Ayun, nakatapak huling huli. Now we'll turn you over to Maris uh, Victoria. Maris? Sandy and Melo, I've spoken with Juan Montes, John Cantibuhan, and he said even though he is still currently recovering from his injury, he still needs to give his best. Sabi niya nga, playoffs na to, hindi na pwedeng basta-basta lang ang ipapakita inside the court. You know, when crucial games like this, he is practicing to be more patient and composed. They reviewed their previous game against San Pedro and they corrected all of their mistakes. Now he just hopes for the team to maintain a leading score gap throughout the ball game. Sandy and Melo? Back to back threes by Ginitaran. 17 to 11. San Pedro coming back here down by six. The PSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure. Official hydration partner, Top Cut Gentleman's Grooming. Prepare for battle. Your healthy life. Japanese Style Clinic. Erase Beauty Care. Isla Capsule. Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf. Media Partners, Fiber TV. Blast TV. Live at IBC 13. Back to back threes for the San pa uh, Pedro Pablo Escobits. Na iwan sila kanina. At ito yung mabal dahil kay. Uh, Ginitaran scoring three, uh, make the two triples. So that's close the power the of uh, the three-pointer. And all of a yeah. sudden, this is just a six-point game. Rich Ginitaran, a surprise, no magic bunot here in this game. Like 8 0 yan kanina. Oh. Eh. Nagpisa tayo sa first period. 17 to 11. San Pedro Pablo Escobes defeated Juan Munti in the el elimination round. 75 to 71. Mark Sarangay. Good defense there by Dirige. The shot won't work. Whoops. Out si Mangahas. So that is a good hustle play. Mula dito kay uh, Homo, Mark I'm sorry, Sarangay. Homo. Homo pala. Ayun, yun, from behind. Tumama sa tuhod. Harold Arboleda. Oh, bad pass. Miscommunication on the part of John Cantimbuan and... Uh, Harold Arboleda. Ini expect ni uh, Harold na nasa corner lang. Oh, oh, yeah. Si Jan Cantimbuan. Pumasok eh. Pero mag si Jan Cantimbuan saw an opening from that baseline kaya uh -huh. went for that back door. Three point field goal natin. Two out of seven for San Pedro and three out of six para dito sa one Monty. Derige providing the screen. Sarangay on him. He goes inside. Left handed layup. That's good. Nice move by Derige. That is a great shot mula dito kay Derige. To the delight of the Pablo 
<laughs> o San Pedro Escobets, rather. <laughs> yeah, nakakita ka rin. Nawala na yung, ano, yung rhythm ba? <laughs> 17-13 now. Under four minutes to go. My partner is Mela Navarro. My name is Sandy Grumo. This is the playoffs of the PSL President's Cup 2024. Michael Mason. he gives it to John Cantimbuan. Oh, that's a travel. For all, I thought it was good. Oh, I thought John Cantimbuan trying to plead his case. But nonetheless, that was good defense. Mula dito kaya Michael Homo. This is that drive from Drigue earlier. Ang hirap. Oh, naman. Showing us that he could also move like a guard. 17-13. And a chance to close the gap here. We have a foul away from the ball. And it's going to be on Homo. Oh, offensive foul. No? As he was Sayang. trying to set a, a screen right there. Kanina po, yung Binyan, yung number one team ay tinalo. Yung RCP Shawarma Shack. Walang resistance guys. Yung uh, second game naman natin, JT Bulacan Taipan. Upset. Tinan, uh, tinalo nila yung SGA CSB Blazers. So may game two pa sila. Harold misses on the three attempt. Mark Sarangay getting the offensive rebound. One-handed shot. He comes up short. Foul is on number four. Zero. That's Felix Apreco. Oh, Felix Apreco got surprised with that call. Tina natin to let. As Mark Sarangay was going up for that shot, he missed. And the yun na huli yung konting tulak from behind. Oh, this is like Michael Machon. All uh, are, are the uh, Juan Monti team shooting uh, 58% here. 7 of 12 from the field. Mark Sarangay for three. Ginitaran. Oh, that was a tight pass intercepted by Riosi Koga. Koga. Oh, a tight pass also there. And they double up on Ginitaran. Oops. Inadvertent whistle. Oh, looks like there's going to be a warning here. Which we saw a wild sequence there. No turnover after turnover. Oh. These both teams, makikita mo yung aggressive. This may halong gigil eh. May halong gigil kasi yung playoffs na eh. Yung emotion natin, yung, yung le nag-level up na rin yung uh, pressure at saka yung pagka-agresibo ng dalawang kupunan. Intercepted by mga has. Kasi nga ito, 8 and 9 eh. So magkadikit. Sabi mo nga kanina, magkapitbahay lang. Derige misses another one from downtown. He is 0 of 3. And I've covered him in... Uh, uh, for what three games? Nakakascore siya sa tres, eh. especially some middle. And talking about uh, one guy who could score from the three-point line, itong si uh, Chris Xavier mm -hmm. is known to take uh, long shots. May and... pantapat sila kay uh, Masyon, no? Uh -huh. 17 13 is the count, two minutes and 24 to go. Rio si Koga way off. Oh, what a rebound there by Ingles coming out of nowhere. That is just pure hustle mula dito kay Ingles beating two white shirts at that time. Ingles in his uh, last game versus San Pedro, he scored 21 points and was shooting 57% from the field. That's 8 of 14. Mangahas looking for a friend. Felix Apreco did not know what to do with the basketball. That is the problem when you give Felix Apreco the ball inside. Oh, oh yeah, no? because... Uh... Itong si Felix Apreco, hindi naman talaga siya scorer eh. Oh. Kaya naman uh, during that time, it was a good sequence for him though. Nakakuha siya ng foul dito kay Mark Sarangay. But that's one thing in his game that he needs to improve on. Oo nga, sabi nga natin, itong si Felix Apreco, kailangan din umiscore. Oh. Hindi lang rebound ng rebound, ano? Felix that Apreco. And Felix Apreco right now on the line. And kung may papasok nito, this could build confidence. Although, he missed the first. You know, Felix Apreco, he is number six in scoring here for uh, for the team. The fans of Felix Apreco. Yun lang naman yung inaantay. Yung supporters dun sa oh. likod ng ring. Eh, kahit naman tayo, pag uh, may supporter na ganyan, ah, ako hindi talaga ako nakascore sa free throw. 19-14, <laughs> and suddenly the game is close. Michael Mason feeling his defender from behind. Very short on the hook shot. Babuena for three. And it goes out of bounds, you know. We have a flopping foul warning on Ken Balbuena. He won, he scored, at, uh, he scored 36 points in their game 
versus JT Bulacan Taipan at the Paco Arena. But so ah, far, San Andres. That was San Andres, uh -huh. by the way. So far, Tong Simashon is, is doing a great job. No? Dito, boxing out si Felix Apreco. Shot clock, 10 seconds. Inglés falling away. Mark Sarangay with the offensive rebound. The drop pass by Inglés. And Mark Sarangay will go to the free throw line. That was a beautiful basketball. Mark Sarangay sharing the ball to uh, Inglés. And Inglés naman returning the favor for that drop pass. At nakikita naman natin itong mga past games ng Juan Munti. No? Yung, uh, they've been in so many close ball games. At, uh, there are many times na may chance din silang manalo. Oo, oh, totoo yan. At saka, yun nga, minsan, masama yung pinapakita nila. Minsan, maganda. Yung last game nila, nag-overtime pa versus Manila. And, and uh, itong si Harold Arboleda nga, naka, at saka itong si uh, Mark Sarangay, maganda yung mga nilalaro nila. And they played minus John Cantimbu on their main scorer. And it's all about consistency para dito sa panic ng uh, Juan Munti. And right now, they're trying to share that basketball because the first game uh, against uh, San Pedro, they lost by 10 in that department. Australia misses again. Michael Mashon against Manila at the Caloacan Sports Complex. Uh, complex scored 12 straight points in the first period. He goes out of bounds. That was too tight para kaya Harold Arboleda trying to sneak that ball pagpunta dito kay Balbuena. San Pedro Pablo Escobets over the foul limit while one Monte two. They still have two more fouls to give. Ken Balbuena operating inside. Masonat expecting the pass. Well, they're trying to pound the ball inside. But the thing is, yung depensa nitong San Pedro is really clogging on that paint. I don't see Jomar uh, Santos coming in for, for uh, San Pedro Pablo Escobets. Mike, oh, nice move by Mike Machon. Finally, a point in the paint para dito sa Juan Monti. They've been dying to get a score in that area. Ando Australia still scoreless from the outside. Homo guarded by Balbuena. Ginitaran inside pass broken up. Ball goes out of bounds. Let's take a look at this play. Ingles, look at that drop pass to Mason and the patience to go for that undergo stop. Dimina uh Madaliba. -huh. Shot clock seven seconds. Andoy four. The baseline attack, broken up by Mark Sarangay. Ken Balbuena. Oh, napalakas ng konti eh. Pero pumasok yung layup ni Ken Balbuena. That was a perfectly timed pass. Andoy now will score from downtown. 25 to 17. And you would see the sign of relief na mula kay Andoy. Knocking down his first Yung una lang naman yung mahirap eh. Oh. Mark inside to Harold. And at the end of one, Juan Munti leading here 25 to 17. The second quarter is coming up next. You're watching the playoffs of the PSL President's Cup 2024. The PSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation. Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentleman's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life, Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, Live at IBC 13. We are back here inside the Field Oil Eco Oil Center. The PSL fans enjoying the action, the playoff action. This is win or go home, by the way, for the lower seed. That's true. Ito ang uh, San Pedro here, no? trying to fight for another day as we take a look at our uh, screen. Ito ang ating mga big boss mm -hmm. here in the PSL. Alan Kaidik, the trigger man. Uh, he is uh, the commissioner, Boss Ote Ronquillo. Vice President of the PSL and Farley Aguila, the uh, basketball operations chief. Second quarter action. My name is Andy Grumo, alongside Melo Navarro. Courts are reporting natin po, I see Maris Victoria.
Well, uh, field goal shooting, 10 out of 22 for Juan Munti, 45% for them on the other side. 6 out of 16 naman para San Pedro, only 37%. James Inglés now with 4 points, and the lead is back to 10 points. Javier De Rigue. He gives it to Javier for three. Yes! That will be their third from downtown. No. Fifth. Specialty of the house right there. Muladi to kay Chris Javier. We mentioned that earlier. This time around, De Rigue driving and kicking it off to Chris. So I'm sure that will be their fourth triple. Two for Guinitaran, one for Estrella, and one for Javier. Oh, bad pass. But it goes out of bounds. Homo is the last one to touch that basketball. Wide open look, wide open three. No problem for Javier to score from beyond the arc. Riose Koga. Ingles back to Koga. And he throws the ball away. That is not the comfort zone of Riose. You know? and, uh, that, I believe that cut was, was just a decoy. He was not ready to accept the pass. Uh -huh. Michael Holm here so far has played good defense and has been facilitating for his team. Michael Machon picks up the foul, his first personal, and the first team foul for Juan Munti. Michael Machon is also the teammate of uh, Michael Maestri when they were in college back in Cebu. A lot of holding and shoving on the ball screen action. Na yan. The three won't work, rebounded by Ken Balbuena. Sabi nga natin, playoffs na eh. Medyo physical na konti, yung uh, laro, mas agresibo na yung mga bata, yung mga players natin. Michael Machon. Short stab, that's good. And he loves that matchup underneath against the Riga. Sabi nga natin, if it's the playoffs, it's all about who wants it more. Yeah. Oh, that's Andoy. He misses the layup. He is one out of five from the field. Nice one. Michael Machon scoring there. Now he has four points. Ando Australia struggling here in the first half. This is the pass of Inglés to Michael Machon, his second field goal of the game. Back in a moment. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Jumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton. Healthy and Pure, official hydration partner, Topcock Gentleman's Grooming. Prepare for battle, your healthy life. Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, live at IBC 13. Sandy and Melo, ang pinakatumatak daw na sinabi ni Coach kay Andrew Estrella is yung mag-enjoy lang because if he loves what he's doing, you'll see passion out of it. Their team needs to improve in decision-making inside the court. Hindi lang daw pwedeng laro ng laro. Mas importante daw maglaro with thinking right and wise. Sandy and Melo. Estrella, misses. I like that. Ano? Just enjoy the ball game. Do what you love. Yung passion nga, ilabas mo. And good things. You could expect good things to happen. Yeah. Pag yun ang mindset mo. That's true, Melo. And the, uh, you know, one Munti sharing the ball well here in the first uh, uh, half compared to uh, San Pedro Pablo Escobet's 10 assists compared to the six. Balbuena. Taken away by Ingles. Deceptive move, short. And it goes out of bounds. And a lot of substitutions here. Alan Mangahas and Doy Estrella back in the game. As well as itong si uh, John Cantimbuhan and Yusei Koga. They waxed hot from beyond the arc yeah. back in the first quarter. Let's take a look at this. Is that drive from Ingles earlier? And he got blocked. Seven minutes and 23 seconds to go. The lead is 11 points for Juan Munti. John Cantibuan is back in the game. The hesitation move in heavy traffic. And a three-second violation. Call there. Michael Machon, you stay there. 
inside the shaded lane. Well, he already positioned himself for that rebound. Akala niya titiran eh. Oh. Itong si Jan Cantimbuhan. Sa marami na din sigas sa maling akala, Melo. Andoy with a strong move inside. Oh. That time around, Andoy Estrella taking it strong to the hoop. He's been struggling from with his outside shots. Kaya naman, that's a veteran for you. No? Talagang dinala niya ngayon sa loob yung kanyang laro. At pag ikaw ang coach ni Andoy Estrella, kailangan mo lang siya palaruin eh. Oh. No? There are types of players na dapat pinapakawalan oh. mo eh. Inglés is free for two. Very short rebounded by Ginitaran. Outside for three. Yes, sir! Andoy from downtown. And that's the result. If you let Andoy Estrella get this rhythm, no? Pakita mo yung very aggressive shot. He's looking for his shots. And the good thing about it is if he's making it right now. Da, uh, that's uh, Koga. Mark Saranga is free for three. Bang, bang, bang! Mark Saranga adding that three-pointer to his game. Grabe, no? Like extending that defense. And look at that move. Technical foul will be called on Jan Cantimbuhan. Ah, kasi may flopping ni siya kanina eh. So... Yun yung mahirap na pag talagang tinamaan ka. Oo oh, eh. May, may warning ka na. Sometimes you could argue, pero yun nga eh. Kasi meron ng uh, warning kanina. And that goes for everyone on the bench. Ito yung nangyari kanina. Oh. And that Estrella drive, itong si uh, John Cantimbuhan fell down on the floor. And uh, our referee saying it was a, it was a flopping nut. So Daryl Karangia not playing here because of an injury they suffered in their previous game. Itong uh, at saka itong si uh, Jomar Santos. Iniinda ano yun? <laughs> Iniinda nila yung mga injuries pa nila eh. Oo. Uh, yan. So a lot of players pa din, ano? Panaka naka. Occasionally pala yan. Ano? Pero mabigat yun eh. No? Kasi those are key players para oh, dito Karangian, sa... Karangia, Jomar oh. Santos. Uh, Parillagas. And what a time for them to nurse those injuries. Mga 30 points din yun, ah. Oo, mabigat-bigat yun. And the, most importantly, yung presence nila on the floor yes, puts yes. stability sa kanilang kupunan. Because Parillagas can soar inside, nakakakuha ng rebound. Uh -huh. Post up, uh, post uh, defender din. Estrella for three. Bang, bang, bang! Sabi ni Andoy, Estrella, kung sino-sino pang hinahanap nyo. Oo. Ako na lang, sabi niya. Andoy Estrella with his second from the three-point territory. <laughs> Mark Sarangay for three. And this time he will miss that one. Javier Estrella. Dribbling violation committed by Andoy Estrella. Nahuli. Hindi naman daw sinasadya, but it happened right in front of our referees. Let's take a look at this action again. Andoy Estrella, ayun! Ay, Totoo naman eh. <laughs> Walang question nyo kasi nga siya, napatawa eh. 34 to 31 is the count. Dahil sa mga tres ng uh, Juan Monte ay nakakabalik sila dito. Oh, no look pass inside. John Cantipon is not happy. Alves, uh, hindi rin niya alam eh. Kung uh -huh. ipapasa, eh, masado siyang uh, madiin sa harap eh. Well, Kantimbuan had a good intention right there, but uh, just oh. pure, uh, poor execution for them. Mangahas puts the move. Slow motion drive, he gets the kind oh. bounce. Yun yung pinaka-slow-mo. Pinaka-mahinang slow-mo na nakita ko sa buong buhay ko. <laughs> pinakita ni Alan Mangahas, you don't need to jump high, you don't need to be quick to score a basket. And San Pedro coming back here down by one as John will miss. And, after, and a chance to take the lead here. After scoring nine points, oh, Antimbuan has gone silent here in this game. For the lead. And intercepted there by Felix. Oh, what a shot there by Felix and Preco. You were, lo you were looking for my offensive production. Here it Ayun. is. Felix and Preco getting that steal, attacking the basket, and getting an end one opportunity. And Felix and Preco with his first field goal of the game. He has three points. Kita mo naman, you know, the anticipation of that outlet pass and yung uh, upper body strength ni Felix Apreco in full display on the last sequence.
Nasabi nga natin kanina nga match na match itong dalawang kuponan, itong San Pedro uh, playing minus Daryl Karangian, uh, Paril Yagas at Jomar Santos, pareho yung tatlo, may mga injuries po. And for a while here, we thought Juan Munti was already cruising to oh. build the big lead, pero ito ngayon, San Pedro back in the game. At nakakakuha ng mga rebound. Oh, the interception by Alves! He will score plus a foul! That is not a good sequence. If you are San Pedro, no? after getting that rebound, another turnover and a masakit dito. And one play pa ang binigay sa Juan Monti. Let's take a look at this again. Anticipated talaga yung pass. Hey, quick hands. And in, better finish right there. Well, San, Pe uh, San Pedro outscoring Juan Monti here 18 to 11 in the second period. Alves completes the three point play. And they are back on top by two, 37 to 35. And San Pedro right now already has nine turnovers in this game. Australia. The floater, yes, now he is on fire. Nakuha na yung kanyang rhythm. Talking about Andoy Australia already has 16 points here in this game. Oh, 16 points, but he missed his first five attempts as Rio Sicoga uh, scoring there from the corner. Long two pointer. Sabi ni Rios, you know, enough is enough. 39-37. Another floater there by Mahas. Tying this ball game at 39-all with three minutes and 21 seconds remaining in the first half. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Top Cock Gentleman's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life, Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, Live at IBC 13. At the for a while kanina, nakita natin sa opisa ng first uh, period, malaki kagad yung kalamangan ng uh, uh, Juan Munti. But all of a sudden, Ando Estrella happened for San Pedro, exploding for 16 big points. And yun nga, naibalik niya yung kanyang kupuna, not only within striking distance, but tying this game and giving the, his team a better chance of closing out this half on a strong note. You know, he missed his five uh, five, uh, first five attempts no kanina. Six out of 12 shooting here. 16 points para kay Ando Australia. Well, his combination with uh, Alan Manga has very effective here late in the second quarter. And you know, John Cantibuan suddenly very cold here in the second period. Harold Cantibuan going around in circles. The strong move. Oh, rebounded by Mohamed Sarep. And that's a travel. Hindi niya alam kung anong gagawin niya sa bola, eh, no? Parang casual yung lakaw, eh. Yung lakad, lakaw naman. Yung lakad, eh. He hesitated right there after getting that emphatic rebound. Oh, Kita mo naman yun, ano? Na yun lang. <laughs> took that extra step. Andoy Australia, Marlon Monte, Felix Supreco. Intercepted there by Harold. Outside we go. Koga. The three. Mohamed misses on the three attempt. Mangahas. Taken away by... John Cantimbuan, easy layup for John. And probably the easiest basket you could get here in this game because it has been tightly contested so far. 41 to 39 is the count. This is the third game of the playoffs of the PSL President's Cup 2024. Estrella misses on the three attempt, picked up by Mahas. Felix Apreku. Alves, the rebound. John Cantimbuan, pinabayaan na lang, eh, no? One of the strengths, itong uh, Juan Munti, yung kanilang running game. And Marlon Monte, that was a fishing expedition. Ang galing niya gumamit ng katawan. Yun. Pag drumive siya talaga, isusubo niya sa'yo yung kanyang upper body. And most often than not, nakakakuha talaga ng foul. Nag-iba uh, yung uh, konti natin, yung field goal percentage. Ang dalawang ko po natin naman naman. Yung uh, San Pedro, 51% shooting na. Itong Juan Munti naman, bumaba 44% shooting from the field here in the first half. But it's probably because ito nga si uh, Luce Koga and John Cantimbuhan. Medyo, medyo na-limit yung uh, production nila ngayon dito. No? Good adjustment 
on the part of San Pedro in terms of defense. Marlon Monte is at the free throw line, his first point there. No field goals for Marlon Monte. Marlon Monte averaging 12 points for his team. And ngayon nga, no, medyo limited pa yung kanyang touches. But this is also one guy who could explode at any given moment. He scored four points in the first game and he was one out of four from the field. De Rige. Marlon gets by Alves. Foul is called on the big guy, Alves. That is already the third foul na nakuha nitong si Marlon every time he attacks the basket, especially going to his right. So if you're Juan Monti right now, you gotta do a better job in closing out the drive. You si know, Marlon. the good thing about Marlon Monti, sinasabi nga natin kanina, volume yun eh. Uh -huh. Ang dami niyang mga attempts kahit hindi niya nakascore. Ang maganda dito, very aggressive siyang pumapasok, nagda-drive sa, sa, sa loob eh. Kahit hindi nakakascore, kahit bangga-bangga lang siya. Dami pera. <laughs> Well, Marlon Monte, a veteran guard. Actually, very stocky, no? Yung kanyang build, eh, talagang pambanggaan, eh, and it's using that to his advantage right now. 43 to 41, and he misses both free throws. One out of three. And that sequence is John will fly in the air, and he overcooks. Rebounded by Mangahas. Mangahas is free. Mark Sarangay is fouled after... He got that rebound. And Mark Sarangay so far has done a great job controlling the boards. Yes. Huh? He's the leading rebounder para sa Juan Monti right now with six. Uh, San Pedro, uh, not yet in the penalty. That's their second rebound of the game. Oh, no, a second foul, a second team foul of the game. 43-41 now. Here is Jean Cantimbuan, 4-3. Oh, what a shot. You get the kind bounce. You know, they're called the shooter's bounce. Really, you know, it's a soft touch. Most likely, it's going to Marlon will answer back with his own version of the three. Quick response right there for Marlon Montes, showing us that he's not just driving his strength. He also has that stroke from cut, beyond the arc. He cuts down the lead to two points, 46-44. to 44. Harold short on the layup. He gets it back in heavy traffic. Shot clock at 10. Riosi Koga. Sarangay providing the screen. Koga with a drive. He overcooks. Rebounded by Felix Apreco. Here is Marlon Monte. He is ahead for the layup. Unable to provide transition defense right there was Juan Munti. Pumalala natin. 22 to 7 in favor of San Pedro. Yung uh, fast break scoring in their first game. So uh, very crucial yan na ma-check ng Juan Munti today. This is the second deadlock of the game. The last time was a 39-0. We are tied now at 46. Harold outside to John. Trying to break the ice. Koga will fire. Picked up by Marlon Monte. This is a three-on-one situation for the lead. And yes, Andoy providing sparks. There was not much John Cantimbuan can do there. Three against one attack. They need to do a better job in sprinting back on defense. Foul is called. Well, they're not yet in the penalty. That will be their third team foul. And he will be warned by the referee. Oh. Nah, we can now mang it. Kasi pag ubanga, technical ni. And I understand itong si uh, or mga warning yan. Toti Celeste is an international referee. Yes. So, kita mo naman yung kanyang uh, mo, uh, ano dun, monster na talagang Wag controlling na. the game. Oh, yeah. oh. Pero uh, I admire yung kanyang ano dun, ha? kumbaga yung Demeanor? pasensya niya oh. dun. Ano? Oh. ano lang naman yun? Maximum tolerance. Oh, oh, totoo, yeah. Maximum tolerance, but With ikaw authority. pa rin yung boss. <laughs> oh, ikaw pa rin yung boss. Well, tatama ka. Koga, 4-3! And you know, Juan Munti started out quick here in the first period, but now, after two quarters, uh, San Pedro Pablo Escobets ahead by two points. Let's take a look at the Dumper Super move of the game brought to us by Dumper Party List. Andoy Australia. 16 points. Now make that 18 points, and that Dumper uh, Super move of the game is brought to us by Dumper party list 48 for San Pedro Pablo Escobet, 46 for Juan Munti. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, 
Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentleman's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life, Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, Live at IBC 13. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentlemen's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life. Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, live at IBC 13. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear. Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentlemen's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life, Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, Live at IBC 13. You are tuning in to PSL Interviews at the Half and with me is none other than Coach Manu Hawk. So Coach Manu, ang ask ko lang po is about PSL Global. So Coach, what made you decide to participate in the Visayas Leg Road to PSL Global Championship? Um, first of all, gusto namin bigyan ng um, magandang opportunities yung mga bata sa New Zealand. And um, there's plenty of talent that we want to showcase. So we, 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 this um, games or these uh, tournaments that PSL is going to have, uh, it's going to be a good platform for our players back in New Zealand to showcase their talent. That's really a big thing, po, Coach Manu. And uh, may, if I may ask, how will this impact your organization? I think it's going to help us out a lot, especially um, adding interest in playing basketball for, um, for our, our organization. And hopefully it will increase also the members of our uh, organization and teams uh, as we go through the uh, next few years. Yeah. All right. Uh, I wish you good luck for your journey ahead. I, I know you have a lot of supporters out there, especially you're building up your organization. Baka may gusto po kayong batiin o pasalamatan? First of all, I'd like to thank our um, official uh, partner, uh, Triple Threat New Zealand and Triple Threat Philippines. Um, they're the ones that supplies our um, apparel and also the, our coaches, um, the parents, and everybody that helps us um, day in, day out with our organization and Team New Zealand uh, as we prepare for uh, the PSL Global. Well, thank you. Thank you so much, Coach Manny. And once again, good luck on your journey ahead of you. Again, this is Filipina Super League interviews at the half. Ladies and gentlemen, the dashing Pablo Escobabes.
minsan pagpapawisan sa pagalingan papatunayan kahit pa minsan maagawan di titigilan na mabawian mahihirapan man may sisigaw na kaya mo yan kaya lalaban lang mas lalo mo pang gagalingan kahit pa madihado di pa rin payag na matalo aabutin yung ring para yung tira pasok sigurado ano man ang magyari lokal ka mano nasa global wag mong kakalimutan ng respeto at pagmamahal Mga ka super fans, you are still tuning in in PSL interviews at the half, and with me is none other than Coach Rolando Herdon. Coach, sabi mo sa akin kanina, very excited kayo sa PSL Global. Matanong ko lang, Coach, what made you participate in PSL Global Championship? Uh, thank you for this opportunity. No, uh, uh, we are excited because. Uh, Marami kasing mga bata na gusto ma makita ng mga talents na sana makatulong ito. That makes me excited to join in the global PSL tournament. Sabi mo kanina, this will be a very big opportunity para sa mga uh, aspiring basketball players. So, how would this impact your organization? Uh, Redol Elite Basketball Club, uh, this will be a big impact para sa... Uh, aming organisasyon, ang PSL, malaki kong tulong. Dahil kasi gusto namin namin mag, ano, to discover some talents to be one day they will be here in Manila seeing action like in the uh, UAP, in CAA, as well as the PSL also and somehow in the PBA maybe. Okay, Coach, good luck po sa journey nyo ahead. And now, this is your time to greet or batiin kung sino man ang pwede mong batiin o hikayatin na man, o, o suportahan ang PSL Global. Uh, sa Bacola na Negros Occidental, uh, it is your opportunity to join the PSL Global uh, in the ages like uh, six, uh, 204 born, 206 born, and 208 born. It is now your opportunity to join uh, sa ating liga na ito. And uh, I would like to uh, take this opportunity to give thanks to the parents of the Red Owl Elite Basketball Club, to the players, uh, to the focal who supports us very much. So as well, uh, ang Bletchers. And those people from Bacolan and Negros Dental, thank you very much for this opportunity. And I hope to see you action, seeing you action in this tournament. And we would like to thank the PE Silusdo for giving us this opportunity to extend your talents and to share talents to be one of the aspiring players in the Philippines in the Philippines someday. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, Coach Rolando. Once again, this is PSL Interviews at the Half. Now stay tuned as PSL will be right back for our second half of the game. The PSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X. Supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentleman's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life, Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, Live at IBC 13. The PSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, 
Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentleman's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life, Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, Live at IBC 13. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentlemen's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life. Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, live at IBC 13. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear. Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentlemen's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life, Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, Live at IBC 13. We are back here inside the Phil Oil Eco Oil Center in San Juan, 48-46. Naman po dito ang San Pedro Pablo Escobets. My name is Sandy Grumo. With me is Melo Navarro. Kanina nga, yung, nung umpisa natin, maganda yung pinakita ng uh, Juan Monte. E dito naman sa last uh, five minutes ng laro ay gumanti itong uh, San Pedro Pablo Escobets. Itong Juan Monte started the game with an 8-0 run in the mid of the second quarter. They threatened to pull away, but itong uh, San Pedro was able to mount a comeback Courtesy nitong si uh, Andoy Estrella who all of a sudden after missing his four or five first shots has turned on the green light and he was unstoppable here in the second quarter. And you know, John Cantimbo was unstoppable back in the first half scoring two triples and uh, nung second half, no, medyo nawala, medyo yung pagka-bench uh, na konti, eh, nag-iba, no? E, tingnan na natin dito yung uh, numbers, ano, San Pedro improving their field goal percentage to 51%. Ito namang Juan Munti from a uh, high of uh, 52 earlier. Bumagsak to uh, 42. Assist natin, 13 to 9. And ang pinaka-crucial dito yung turnovers. Dahil nagkakaroon na ng uh, 9 turnovers ang parehong kupunan. And na nakoconvert nila yan to 11 points apiece. And yung ating points in the paint here in this game, almost identical, 22 to 20 for both our teams. Ando Estrella, top scoring for uh, San Pedro Pablo Escobet. He missed his fi uh, 5 uh, shots in the uh, first period and uh, finishing the game high ito naman sa kabila, si John Cantimbuan e sabi ko nga kanina pag uh, masyadong matagal yung upo mo eh, mananabot ka rin eh and here are the leading scorers, Andoy Estrella with 18, Monte with 7, Giritaran with 6 Mangas with 6 on the other side Cantimbuan naman, 16 points, Koga with 8 Mashon and Sarangay with 6 and 5 apiece Mangas, malaki din na itulo niya kanina sa pag-rally uh, uh, pag nila. No? At uh, first two points para kay Mangas dito sa uh, third period. And the good thing about Alan Mangas, yung mga galaw na yung puro sigurado. Eh, no? Slowly but surely. Mahina ba? Pero epektibo naman. Oh, very deceiving. The three. Good defense there. Oh! Tinignan lang ni Andoy itong si uh, Harold Arboleda. Harold Arboleda has been doing that since his college days, no? yung mga offensive rebounds and second chance points. Mga has. No look pass to Marlon Monte for two! A very deceptive pass there uh, by Alan Mangahas. That's a veteran move right there. Alan Mangahas looking away. He was just waiting for that backdoor cut and kitang kita naman natin. Saktong sakto yung pasa. Largest lead of uh, San Pedro Pablo Escobets, 52 to 48. Shot clock reads at eight. Mark Sarangay sees space. He goes inside. Basket is good for the big guy, Mark Sarangay. Great execution of that two-man game. Ryusei Koga giving that pocket pass to Mark Sarangay for the easy two. Estrella. What a shot there. Parang off-timing. Parang uh, 
yung paaba. <laughs> Oo, oh, eh, kontra tempo yung oh. floater na yon itong si Andoy Estrella. Kung tayo gumawa nun, tawag doon fear drop. <laughs> ah, no, no? May konting takot eh. <laughs> fear drop, bago yun ah. Okay ah. Inside to uh, Alves. And look at that. Uh, Harold Arboleda is playing hurt right now. He is favoring that uh, left foot. Or maybe right. The three won't work. Malakas yung tira ni Marlon Monte. Naiwan lahat ni Jan Cantimbuhan. At pumasok yung layup. Jan Cantimbuhan using his speed to get that layup against uh, Felix Apreco. And si Felix didn't risk getting his third foul here in the game. Third deadlock of the game. I'm sure it's the fourth deadlock of the game. Derige. Mangas looking at the shot clock. Oh, that was a soft pass there by by, by Mangas. Oh. <laughs> but uh, once again, Alan Mangas trying to facilitate para dito sa San Pedro. Four lead changes and four deadlocks here in the game. Koga scores from downtown. And the lead is three for one Monte. You say Koga is very deadly off those handoffs. So, kailangan talaga mas switch or mag hard show every time he's involved. Malakas yung uh, tira ni Andoy. A preco. Blocked by Arboleda. A break right there, getting another opportunity. Just couldn't capitalize because of the defense. Naren itong si Mark Sarangay. Arboleda met by Apreku. Australia defending Riosi Koga. He goes to the baseline. Left-handed attack is good. Quick first step going to the baseline by Riosi Koga. Napakagandang crossover. And then Andoy Australia was expecting help side from that time. So a 5 to nothing run here by Juan Munti Mangahas. Andoy fakes. He goes inside the floater. He overcooks. Dirige, the offensive rebound. Reverse. He comes up empty. Rebounded by Mark Sarangay. And another uh, sequence right there where Tung San Pedro got a lot of opportunities. Pero yun nga, parang yun nangyari back in the first quarter. Hindi nila maipukol yung mga tira. Well, sa, sa tingin ko nga, eh, medyo nagmamadali sila na oh, makakaskor. Okay. Ano? Alves. Offensive foul ang tatawag kay Harold Arboleda. Kasi nag-screen siya after uh, he made that pass. Tried to force the issue right there. Talking about Harold Arboleda. Let's take a look at that again. Oh, Ayun eh, si Neil pa yan. Ganda na nung pasa sana eh. At wala naman magagawa si uh, ano dun eh, no? Si uh, Felix Epreco. Derige, hesitating. Mangas will not hesitate. And he gets it from downtown. And Manga has silently creating damage here in this game. He already has 11 points, 5 rebounds, and 5 assists. 59 to 57, and he cuts down the lead to 2 points. Mark Sarangay guarded by Derige. Sarangay feeling his defender from behind. He gives it to Alves. Mark Sarangay, one offensive rebound. The hook shot, it rims out. Rebounded by Derige. Marlon Monte with the attack. Rebounded by Mark. Good defense right there from Harold Arboleda. Tinaasan lang talaga ng kamay. Hindi nakakuha ng foul that time si Marlon. Harold Arboleda puts the move. He gives it to John Cantimbuhan for the left-handed layup. John Cantimbuhan scoring his 20th point here in the game. And uh, that's Harold Arboleda's fourth assist. At nakikita natin si uh, Marlon Monte. Parang may iniinde. The three won't work. Rebounded by Riosi Koga. Tignan mo yung takbo ni Marlon Monte, oh. Mark Sarangay, Koga. Shot clock at 15 seconds, under five minutes to go. 61-57. Welcome to the playoffs, ladies and gentlemen. The number eight seed, Juan Monte versus the number nine seed as Alves will score from the outside. 63-57. Juan Monte, they are back on top. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentleman's Grooming. 
Prepare for battle. Your healthy life. Japanese Style Clinic. Erase Beauty Care. Isla Capsule. Marketing Partner. Bean Leaf. Media Partners. Fiber TV. Blast TV. Live at IBC 13. John Cantimbuan playing 20 minutes here in this game. And he is shooting one out of five. Make that uh, nine of 15 from the field here. 20 points, three assists. And before the start of the game, sabi nga niya, no, talagang gustong-gusto niya makabawi because uh, he missed their last few games. And alam naman nga niya yung uh, impact niya in his team every time he plays good. And so far, kung si Ajan Cantimbuan has been living up to the expectations. The main guy for Juan Monti. And he's the leading scorer also. 63-57. And San Pedro Pablo Escobar was forced to call a timeout there as Ando Estrella uh, turned the ball over. Alves is fouled by Dirige. He forced the issue, I can say. Uh oh, that was a bailout uh, call right there. Para dito kay, uh, kay Alves. And one guy na medyo tumahimik din. Itong si Rich Ginitaran was able to knock down two three pointers earlier, but after that. In a limit na yung kanyang touches. Alves at the line. Uh, seven points, three rebounds here. Now he has eight points. Four minutes and 22 seconds remaining in the third period. Bench points para sa one munti. 19 points dito, uh, Melo. Well, that's a huge factor here in this game. Everybody contributing para dito sa panic ng one munti. Ginitaran is in the game now. Mangahas back to Javier for three. Bang, bang, bang! Chris Javier scoring off that kickout pass by Alan Mangahas. Sabi nga natin kanina, Chris Javier is one of the, is a perfect definition of a stretch four. Inside to Alves. Nice shot there by Alves plus a foul. And what a pass. Mula dito kay Harold Arboleda. Three steps away from the three-point line, giving that alley -oop pass. Inamuto. Perfectly timed and an even better catch. Mula dito kay Alves. So Alves will try to complete the three-point play. And he completes the three-point play. The lead is seven points, 67 to 60. Juan Monti led by as many as 13 points. San Pedro Pablo Escobar led by as many as two. Felix Apreco. Apreco very quiet in this game. Three points and five rebounds. It goes out of bounds. And will go back to Juan Monti. And turnovers starting to pile up. Para di sa panic ng uh, San Pedro. That's already... Turnover number 13 for them. Three minutes and 37 seconds remaining in the uh, third period. Foul is called, and that will be the second team. I'll make that third team foul for the San Pedro Pablo Escobets. And that's what I love about players, you know. Talagang hindi aamin. Hindi na, hindi aamin yan. Huwag kang aamin. Kahit, uh, alam mo naman yan, eh. <laughs> Kahit nahuli ka na, huwag kang aamin. Alam na alam ni uh, Coach Mark Dandan yan. Ah, alam mo na alam. As Alves will score again. Alves so far has been the man of the hour. 13 points here in this game. Javier. Outside to Mangahas. Nice pass inside. Javier to Felix, who's not expecting the pass. That was a case of uh, too unselfish. Para dito kay uh, Chris Javier already has, has a shot right there. 69 to 60. A nine point lead for Juan Munti. We all see Koga, John Cantimbu on the high man. 4-3. Good defense there by Javier. Mangahas crossing the timeline. He looks for a friend. Felix Apreco getting closer. Outside we go to Mangahas. 
He fakes inside to Felix Apreco. Nowhere to go. Mangas will shoot and he will miss. Rebounded by Harold Armoleda. That is good defense. Mula dito sa one Monty. Initially, they were able to stop that transition attack and do naman sa perimeter defense. Wala talaga nakuwang buta si San Pedro. Real C. Koga. Homo defending. Arboleda. Shot clock at five. The drive by John Cantimbuhan. And uh, Harold Arboleda right there putting on the goggles. Six assist for the uh, main guard. Matatawag mo, eh, no? Para dito sa one Munti. An 11 point lead for one Munti. Homo. The drive short on the release. And what about Harold Arboleda? Already has nine rebounds here in this game, facilitating para sa kanyang kupunan. What a uh, luxury to have a guy like Harold Arboleda, no? Five assists and only two points in the game. <laughs> John Cantimbuhan inside to Alves. Rebounded by Ginitaran. Ginitaran will go all the way. Oh, what a shot by Ginitaran! Sinadya ba yun? He wasn't even looking at the ring that time. Rich Ginitaran putting on a show right now. Definitely his first a highlight two points, moving. <laughs> yeah, oh, his first two points here in the third. Less than a minute ago. Nice shot by Riosi Koga from downtown. And that's got to hurt if you're San Pedro. Yeah. Riosi Koga knocking down the three-pointer over the outstretched arms of Chris Xavier. Mangas. Ginitaran. Scored a field goal earlier. Seven to shoot. Foul is cold. It's going to be on Sarangay. It's not in the active shooting. They're not yet in the penalty. That will be their second team foul. Napangiti si Mike Sarangay. Dokana niya mga kalusut eh. Mike Machon comes in for Alves. Alves. Made a good presence here oh, oh, in the third. Much needed the rest. Mula dito kay Alves. 13 points already for this. Uh, Lanky player. You know, you, you have to admire the big heart of the San Pedro Pablo Escobets as uh, they turn the ball over. They are playing minus uh, their number one scorer, Jomar Santos. Uh, no Parillagas there. Daryl Carrigan also because of an injury. Easily, that's already about 30 points yes. a ball game. This could be the final shot or the final possession of the third period. 74 62. Antimbuan is on fire. Mark Sarangay, a preco on him. Mike Machon. Sayang. Hindi alam ni Mike Machon. No. Our score here is 74 to 62. At the end of the third, we'll be right back. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentlemen's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life. Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, live at IBC 13. Riosi Koga scoring from the outside. Good numbers for him, 16 points, 6 out of 12 from the field, and 6 assists. These are decent numbers para kay uh, Ryusei Koga, no? showing us that he really shows up in big games. And nakita na a variety of attacks for him, knocking down threes, attacking the basket with those layups. And uh, Ryusei Koga, ever since his college days, is really known to be a scoring guard. Maganda sana yung umpisa ng uh, uh, San Pedro kasi tumabla sila sa 45, eh, no? And after that, wala na. Uh, one Monte outscoring uh, San Pedro, 28 to 14 in the third. Doon na That's high, yung, huh? Doon this na is the playoffs. Fatigue, eh, no? uh -oh. Eight man rotation ng yata ang gamit ni uh, 
coach, eh, no? Totoo. Sarangay inside in heavy traffic. He throws it up using the glass and will score. Pumahana. And this is the largest lead of the game. Pumahana parang foul si Mark Sarangay doon. You know, what a beautiful move from the big guy. Estrella. Inside pass is broken up by Inglis. John Cantimpuan goes downhill and he comes up short. Rebounded by Javier. Andoy. This is our quarter score. You know, very high second uh, quarter. 31 points for Escobets. Pero sinagot naman yan with a 28-point explosion in the third quarter by Juan Munti. You know, Homo, very aggressive that time. He, he was not able to score. And he challenged Mark Sarangay in the rebounding duel. Look at this one. Michael Homo in the land of the giants. Ito makikita talaga, no? Laki ng puso nitong si Michael Homo never backing down from any type of action. 76 to 62. Oh, and they're not shooting well from the free throw line. Five out of ten now from the line. And he missed both free throws rebounded by Sarangay. Masakit yun if you're uh, trying to cut the lead down. Inside to John, unmolested. And Arboleda with the assist. Harold Arboleda just showing us how good passer he is in this game. You know, uh, John Cantimbo, maybe the main, their main guy in terms of scoring, but their heart and soul is Harold Arboleda. Estrella for three, he misfires. It goes out of bounds, so not are going in to mga tira ng uh, San Pedro Pablo Escobets. And going back to Harold Arboleda, yung value niya, eh, no? hindi mo talaga matatawaran. Look at that pass to the uh, cutting John Cantimbuhan. Like, he could play multiple possessions, uh, guard yung mga bigs, guard smalls. Yung so, connection nilang oh, dalawa talaga. Eh, yun yung importante ron. Uh, Harold Arboleda right now, kita mo naman, 23 assists for one munti. And yung uh, pito dyan, Galing nga dito kay Harold Arboleda. You know, Harold Arboleda and uh, John Cantimbuan, they have a uh, better connection than your internet. Outside for three, Inglis. Tatawagan ng foul itong si Andoy Estrella. Napuestuhan siya that time itong si uh, Aviles. A loose ball foul, so... Uh, Ito yung mahirap kasi malaki na yung kalamangan sa fourth quarter pa. Uh -huh. And you are playing against time and the team. Inglis, one-handed shot. Picked up by Ginitaran. Ginitaran with a strong move. Basket counts and a foul. That is a good read mula dito kay Rich Ginitaran. Hindi hinarang yung kanyang penetration. That's why he really went up strong to the hoop, challenging two black shirts, which results in naman to in and out move, taking it strong with a two foot jump, scoring that basket for the end one. Yinitaran at the line. His numbers 10 points, four rebounds, and one assist. Plenty of time remaining here, and he will not complete the three point play. Picked up by Harold Arboleda. Aves fakes and will score. Another uh, point in the paint para dito kay Alves and another assist for Harold Arboleda. Power point guard ang nilalaro ngayon. The three is good. Alan Mangahas from downtown. Alan Mangahas is not yet done. 14 points here in this game. 80-67 is the count. A 13-point lead for Juan Munti. Alves spins. Cantimbuan with the reverse. Look at the ball movement of Juan Munti. And Cantimbuan right now operating underneath. Earlier he was draining threes right now. Really going for those high percentage you know, shots. John Cantimbuan moves a lot without the basketball. Oh, totoo yan. The three. Yes, Ginitaran from downtown. Rich Ginitaran knocking down his three, uh, third three-pointer here in this game. And the Harold Arboleda, hindi nakahabol doon, got hit in the face. You know, the third quarter was a bad quarter for 
San Pedro Pablo Escobar. They've been missing a lot of shots there from the field. As Michael is wide open for two, it bounces out. Rebounded by Guinetaran. A chance to close the gap here. He will go inside. Oh, what a shot! That's one for the highlight reel. A dipsy doom mula dito kay Rich Guinetaran cutting this lead down to single digits. 81 to 72. Tina mo naman, Rich Guinetaran absorbing the contact, scanning the floor, being creative for that beautiful shot. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentlemen's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life, Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, live at IBC 13. Eighty-two, seventy-two. Our face of the game is Abby Rubues. Uh, he will, she will get uh, the uh, Erase Beauty Care products. Our, that's our, our face of the game, Abby Rubues. And alam naman natin, a beautiful game deserves a beautiful face. Yes. John Cantimbuan, moving left and right. You know, Michael Mashon. Almost turned the ball over as Haro will score from downtown. Scoring when it's needed. In the Haro Darboleda favoring yung kanyang uh, left foot, but still able to contribute for his team. 85 72. Alan Mangas working against Ingles. Andoy misses. Rebounded by Alves. Inside to Michael Machon. And rebounded by Dirige. Mangahas for three. Mangahas and Harold Arboleda, they are talking to each other. John Cantimbuan with the basketball. 26 points, one rebound, five assists. What a move there by John. Now he has 28 points. 87 72. Nice move there by John. In heavy traffic, he was able to score the ball. Trickle down. Back in the ball. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Party List. C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentlemen's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life, Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf. Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, live at IBC 13. John Cantimbuan, a game high, 28 points. Uh, two rebounds and five assists. The block there inside by Juan Munti, into the hands of John Cantimbuan. He will go all the way, now he has 30 points, Melo. John Cantimbuan really making up for those missed games. 30 big points in a playoff game for John. 89-72, Ginitaran way out, very short. Derige will score. Isa pa, itong si Derige dito sa second half, eh, medyo anoy yung uh, offense niya ay uh, wala. Na limit talaga, no? To, uh, just only seven points. Itinan natin, so points in the paint, a huge difference in yep. this ball game. 50 for one Munti and only 30 for San Pedro. A lot of those points in the paint, hindi galing sa big man, eh. Mm. Yung mga atake nitong mga guards, the likes of uh, Rusey Koga, especially itong si uh, John Cantimbuhan, who has been operating underneath with those sneaky backdoor cuts. Andoy changing direction, finds Mangas from the corner for three. Marlon Monte with the offensive rebound. A preco inside for two. 
match needed basket mula dito yeah. kay Felix Apreku. Doon siya effective eh, no? yung mga drop passes, second chance opportunities. Tsaka 2 minutes lang hindi nakaka-score after nung 3 uh, ni Ginitaran. Oo, oh, mabigat yun. Mark Sarangay with a floater. Hindi pa tapos itong Juan Monti with 4.09 to go. 91-76. This is still a winnable game for San Pedro but they cannot afford to just trade baskets yes, with Juan Monti. Yes, that's true. Good point there. Andoy attacks the baseline. Finds trouble with it. Inside to Marlon Monte. Good presence of mind there by Andoy Estrella. No, itong si uh, Ingles already thought na maagaw na nila eh. He was caught napping on the weak side there. Cantimbuan puts the move. Left-handed layup. Hindi pa siya tapos. 32 big points here in the playoffs. What a shot from Jan Cantimbuan. An off-foot layup going to his left. If I'm not mistaken, this is his... Best game so far in terms of scoring as uh, Marlon Monte will score inside his second field goal here. In the fourth. Ito ngayon, Harden Buleta will try to slow things down, use some clock because they have the advantage. Oh, foul is called. Now we told you, uh, we'll uh, turn you over to Maris Victoria. Maris? San Pedro Pablo Escobet's Felix Apreco told me he is focusing more in practicing his shooting. He said this is already the playoffs, so he needs to exert double, double effort and contribute in his team's success. Kasi nga, super natu-challenge siya sa mga shootings niya, katulad ganina sa free throw. Sandy and Melo? Thank you very much, Maris. If Juan Munti will win, they will face the number one team, Binyan, who defeated the RCP Shawarma Shack demigods, and Alves will score. Maganda yung bracket point nila eh, here, no? Uh, Magkakapit-bahay eh. Konting uh, masakit-sakit to, ha? Oo, yun. Alam naman natin, Juan Munti nga in San Pedro. And malapit-lapit lang din sa kanitong Binyan. But that is such a powerhouse team. But, uh, they need to be healthy. That's all I can say. Homo will go. He is fouled. Homo with that fishing expedition. Getting a foul against Haro Darboleda. This is one tough guy talking about Homo, you know, one of the smallest guards that we have, but definitely putting up a lot of fight in him. So now the bench of uh, Juan Munti coming in here, the Los Reyes, Hiralao, they will join Sarangay, Ingles, and Alves. Much needed rest for the two uh, scorers, the two leaders of Juan Munti, John Cantibuan and Harold Arboleda. No, they're going to need all the rest that they can get because they could expect uh, itong Binyana no, to go all guns blazing against yeah. them. Homo is at the line. Tumabla na yata. Tumabla si na kanina sa 45 eh. After nung uh, offensive onslaught ng uh, San Pedro Pablo Escobar, nakabaway ka agad itong Juan Monti Totoo because yan. of Harold Arboleda's playmaking. Andoy, floater, wala. Andoy gets it back, wala pa rin. Apreco, fakes, he goes inside, yes. Juan Monti needs to be careful here, they're not yet out of the woods. Michael Machon will not force the issue. 204 to go. Ingles. Final two minutes of the game. Derige trying to steal it. Recovered by Inglis. Shot clock at one. A 24 second shot clock violation. And although they missed that shot, eh, malaki laki yung oras na nagamit nila doon, no? to their advantage. Tung San Pedro needs to score quick here. And San Pedro again playing minus uh, Pariliagas, Jomar Santos, and Daryl. Uh, Karangian. All three can score. Andoy will score. Steal and basket. Para sa San Pedro Pablo Escobets. Sam lang to. 4 0. That's uh, Felix Ipreco. San Pedro trying to go for the last push here in this game and. Uh, Juan Monti not leaving anything to chance, putting back in the game. <laughs> the leader. Oh, the leader. The heart Harold. and soul, Harold Alboleda. Who has 
11 rebounds and 12 rebounds rather and 9 assists. Ano Heralao. Draws the double coverage from the top. Outside to Mark. The three, yes! That's gotta hurt. That could be the nail in the coffin. Oh. It's De Los Reyes scoring from beyond the arc. And Ginitaran misses outside. Dirige. Also very quiet in this game. It goes out of bounds. That sums up the game of the San Pedro Pablo Escobets. They're ending the game how they started it. Getting open shots, pero hindi nila maipasok. Yes. San Pedro defeated uh, Juan Munti in the uh, elimination round. 75 to 71. Payback time for Juan Munti at, uh, with 50 seconds to go. And I like the adjustments that ginawa ng Juan Munti dito. No? They really shared the basketball. Oh, no. This is not yet over. San Pedro down by only 11 points. Turnover starting to hurt them. That is turnover number 18 for Juan Munti. Oh, they need to score quick baskets here. 97-88. Nung din na ba sila Harod sa kasi Jan Cantibuan? Nakahabol eh, no? Oo. Foul is called on Homo. Nagkaroon din ng kumpiyansa itong San Pedro to employ their full court pressure because they know na wala nga yung mga veteranong ball handlers. Harold with the move, short. 36 seconds. Ginitaran spins. He throws it up. Felix Apreco getting the offensive rebound. And he is fouled. He will go to the line. And he cuts down the lead to seven points. So this is a three possession game. And that is how strong Felix Apreco is against three black shirts. Still able to get that basketball. Look at that. Look at the hustle. But the upper body strength, despite the contact from Mark Saranga, is still able to finish. So, Felix Sepreco with uh, nine points and six rebounds. And he completes the three-point play. Now he has ten points in the game. And one Munti want to talk, uh, wants to talk things over. 97-91. The BSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Partilist, C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentlemen's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life. Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf, Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, live at IBC 13. Uh, games tomorrow at the Paco Arena, Nueva Ecija, uh, Capitals versus the Manila City Stars. Second game, 6 p.m., Miss Orm Mustangs versus the Dove Occidental Tigers. That's a good one. San Juan Kings versus the Cam Norte Warriors, our main game. Exciting games you have tomorrow, pero ngayon, ano, hindi pa nga natatapos. Game pala natin yung bukas. Oh, eh. yung, uh, I'll be covering the first two games tomorrow, pero yung ngayon nga, itong San Pedro, they're not going down without a fight. Oh, oh. In San Pedro, uh, San, they're not yet in the penalty. San Pedro, Pablo Escobar is not yet in the penalty. Foul is called on Homo. Ngayon natin to, no? Harold Arboleda found himself in trouble. Sabi niya, tinamaan siya sa oh, ulo eh. John Cantibuan will throw it in. They will review it. Are they going to review it? Oh, I think there's going to be a challenge. Yeah. Uh, it's a challenge ng San Pedro. No. Uh -huh. Kasi, yung uh, mga coaches, may isang uh, challenge sa buong game eh. Na hindi makukunan yung timeouts nila. So this is going to be interesting. Haro Darboleda got trapped in the backcourt.
That's a close call. From another angle here. Ang kinukomplain ng San Pedro, bola. Oo. Ang kinukomplain ng San Pedro, Ordinary foul ang itatawag tayo po po. The coach's challenge is unsuccessful. Sumabit eh no? On that pass of Haro Darboleda. Napakasundot itong si Michael Homo. 24 seconds to go. 97-91. 15 seconds. Arboleda. It goes out of bounds. 12 seconds to go. Yung sinasabi nga natin kanina. Pag-usapan natin ulit yan. Tingnan natin muna ito. Ayun. The hustle play mula dito kay Michael Homo. They're gonna call a timeout and they're gonna need a quick basket here. We'll be right back. The PSL President's Cup 2024 is brought to you by Dumper Partilist. C Prime Business Financing Corporation, Converge Fiber X, supported by Kalos PH Sportswear, Hyundai Home Appliances, MDC Sports, Finn Cotton, Healthy and Pure, Official Hydration Partner, Topcock Gentlemen's Grooming, Prepare for Battle, Your Healthy Life, Japanese Style Clinic, Erase Beauty Care, Isla Capsule, Marketing Partner, Bean Leaf. Media Partners, Fiber TV, Blast TV, live at IBC 13. Nakita natin kanina during their break, si Harold Arboleda na yung uh, gumamit ng board nila. Oh, that goes to show the, the trust and the leadership that he has in Ayun. this team. Kita mo naman, no? <laughs> Nakita oh. pala talaga ng camera man natin. Huling huli. Uh -oh. And it's not far With the way he's playing, si Harold Arboleda could be a good coach. Yes, yes. He understands the game, knows how to facilitate. Only five points, but has 12 rebounds. And Three assists, yeah. Oh, nine assists, almost double double performance. Yang nine assists na yan, easily mo convert. Po 18 points na rin yan for him. At yung mga assists niya, binibigyan niya dun, si John Cantimbo. Oh. Expect a three here. Estrella fakes. He will try to score from beyond the arc. Ginitaran short. I think this will be over. Yes. It all boiled down to that one last stop para dito sa Juan Munti. And Juan Munti eliminating the San Pedro Pablo Escobets. 97 to 90, 91. Not without a scare though. And our uh, dumper super move of the game is none other than John Catimbuan. Dumper super move of the game. The game high. 32 points. John Cantimbuan leading the way para dito sa Juan Munti. Capped off with that off-foot layup. Kita mo naman talagang contra tempo. Even Felix Apreco could not challenge that shot. Our Topcock defensive play of the game brought to us by Topcock. Prepare for battle. The denial there, the rejection by Alves. And it turns out to be a fast break opportunity. And the two points para kay John Cantimbuan. There's the block by Alves. And transition offense para naman kay uh, John Cantimbuan. And our uh, super, uh, our Kalos super player of the game is uh, John Cantimbuan. We'll turn you over now to Maris. Tables have turned for one Munti, di ba? Alam naman natin, natalo kayo ng Pablo Escobets nung eliminations. Pero ngayon, ikaw pa ang naging Carlos PH Super Player of the Game. Matanong ko lang, John, what was different before nung uh, eliminations round? but natalo kayo? At ngayon, nakabawi kayo? Uh, first of all, thank you kay God sa binigay niya sa amin panalo. Uh, Pinaganda namin sila, so... Uh, yung pagkatalo namin ng eliminations, doon kami natuto. So, kailangan namin mag-bounce back ngayon, lalong-lalong ngayon, playoffs. 
Uh, kumbaga, hindi na kami papayag magka-game 2 kasi mawawala sa amin yung momentum. So, sabi ko sa mga teammate ko, nag-usap-usap kami, nag kami na bigay na namin yung best namin para makapagpahinga na rin kami, makapagganda kami sa next round, which is a semi. So, yun. Binigay namin yung best effort namin today sa game. So, thank you kay God, binigay yung panalo sa amin. Ang ganda ng mindset mo, kanina sabi mo sa akin, kahit may iniinda kang injury, di ba? You're still recovering per injury. Ganyan pa rin ang mindset mo. So ngayon, madaming sumusuporta sa One Monty. Baka may gusto kang pasalamatan o batiin. Uh, first of all, thank you ulit kay God na hindi ako magsawang pasalamat sa binibigay niya sa akin blessings. So binabati ko yung family ko, kay mama, kay kuya, kay Charm, sa anak ko, kay Brayden, kay Sekon, syempre sa mahal kong asawa, kay Kat. Uh, sa buong family ko at sa mga tropa sa amin and thank you sa mga sponsors namin lalo kay Boss Sherwin Sibilla ng Sure Home so yun maraming maraming salamat sa inyo at sana supportahan nyo pa yung PSL and thank you sa PSL sa binibigay sa aming opportunity so na-showcase namin yung talent namin dito sa liga na to Thank you so much John and congratulations again for being our Carlos PH Super Player of the Game Gentlemen all right, thank you very much, uh, Maris uh, Victoria. There you go, our playoff picture. Well, ito nga, Juan Monti advancing to the next round, and they are going to face a powerhouse team, Binyan. All right, so uh, thank you to uh, Maris Victoria, our courtside reporter, Nori Uy of Nudge Productions, my partner here, Mela Navarro. My name is Sandy Grumo from the Filo Oil Equal Center in San Juan. Mayong gabi, kaninyong tanan.